Yay! Yay! Hello, hello! It says I'm live, so I'm gonna trust it to say that I'm live. <laughs> hi! Okay, let me say hi to everyone. So, hi Mary, when you get off of work. Hi, Victoria and her family. So wonderful. Oh my gosh, I have my sound on. <laughs> hi, Matt! Oh my goodness, Matt. It's gonna be so much fun. You'll see one of the movements that is very core like. <laughs> hi, Emma, Chrissy, Farida. Uh, L. St. Clair. Ooh, Leanne, you made it this time. I'm so happy you can make it. Sonia, Leah. Oh, thank you so much for letting me know. You can see me. Leonora, awesome, awesome. I'm so excited that you are gonna work out with us. It's so exciting, so exciting. Oh my goodness. All right, guys, so today we have a full body workout. I'm gonna put this down. Why am I still holding this? <laughs> we have a full body workout. It's gonna be all cardio strength and abs. 45 seconds on, 15 seconds rest. During the 15 seconds, I'll tell you exactly what the next movement is. I'll be using a set of 15 pound dumbbells today. So remember to challenge yourself with weights, but use weights that allow you to have perfect form. So we are gonna get warmed up. I hope you guys are ready. I'm excited, I had the, the nerviness. If you watched my vlog, um, yeah, if you watched my vlog, you, you saw me being all nervy. <laughs> all right, so let's go ahead and start by bouncing it out and add some punches. So jab cross, getting those shoulders ready and warmed up. Just bounce it out on the balls of your feet. I said balls. <laughs> Three, two, one, and butt kickers. Remember when you do those butt kickers, drive your knees in front slightly, not so much like this. But bring them up in front just a little bit. Three, two, one and arms out, feet out. We're gonna kick across that body. Try to exhale every time you kick across so that way we get a nice crunch for that core. So we're warming up that core. You get a little bit of stretch for those hammies. If you can't reach your feet, no big deal. Just go as far as you can. And let's go three, two, one, and come on down to the ground. We're gonna walk it. And from here, we got plank jacks. So you're jump the feet out. If that's too much, you can always tap it. Getting the shoulders, the core, getting the quads. Keep it up, guys. Four, three, two, one. And go ahead, let's go into a side plank. Rotate your arm and switch. Rotate and switch. If that's too much, you can always come to the knees and switch. Getting those shoulders, getting the obliques. Keep those hands right under the shoulder. Let's go one more each side. Last one, and go ahead, flip it around time. We're gonna have our fingertips facing towards the feet, hands under the shoulders, feet out wide. Tuck your chin, your chest, press up, and bring it back down. So this is reverse tabletop, starting to stretch out those biceps. Squeeze that booty at the top. I'm getting warm. <laughs> I feel warm. Let's go three more. Last two. One more. And roll back and reach through. Remember not to roll on your head or your neck. Really tuck those knees in. So keep them by that nose. But don't punch yourself. <laughs> You'll find yourself Probably sliding back a little bit. That's normal. Let's go two more. Last one. And let's stay here in the seated position. Feet are gonna be out wide, hands behind you. We're gonna dip those hips side to side. So just make sure both knees can touch the ground. So that way you get real nice mobility for those hips. And let's stop on the left side and go ahead and turn and look over your right shoulder. So it should be even greater stretch for those hips. And then let's go ahead and switch. Now look over that left shoulder. Really try to keep those knees on the ground. Press up into those hands. And nice job. Flip it back around into plank. Drive those knees in. We got mountain climbers. Remember, you can always slow it down to go at your own pace. Keep it up, guys. Neck is neutral. 
Driving those knees in, keeping the butt down, hands over the shoulders. Let's go for three, two, one, and press back into down dog, bicycle out those feet. Really trying to bring these heels as close to the ground as you can. So those calves really feel it. Let's go for three, two, one, and go ahead, shift forward, jump or step. Up to the hands, big arms, big inhale. Ah, we're alive. And sprinkle, sprinkle down, sprinkle, sprinkle, and bounce it out. Everyone's like, what about sparkle, sparkle? <laughs> Keep it going. And jumping jacks. Bringing those feet out wide. Gotta make sure we're ready for a workout so we don't have any injuries. Let's go for four, three, two, and one. All right, from here, toes are gonna be facing out. Keep your chest up. We're gonna sink back. Bring your arms all the way up. Open up that chest. Exhale, swoop down. Inhale, bring it up. Make sure you're still pushing your butt back. And when you come up, lean back slightly. So we get a nice stretch for that spine, especially if you're just starting to start your day. Shaking it up after sleeping. Or if you just came back from work. Let's go two more. Big inhale, exhale, swoop down. Last one. And swoopy swoop. Hey, stay down here with me. Now pulse it out. <laughs> this is where we get to dance a little bit. Inner and outer thighs, quads, body getting warm, back is flat. Let's go for three, two, one, and go ahead, shake it out. Ooh, you'll probably have to shake it out just a little bit. Almost done warming up, guys. So stabilize on that right foot. We got a front kick, back kick. If you need a tap down in between, go for it. We are warming up those stabilizers. Getting ready before we start adding weight and kick. Remember, sometimes our balance is off for no reason at all. <laughs> sometimes we have those days. Let's go one more each. Ooh, booty's feeling it. And let's go ahead and switch. Kick, push, kick, push. <laughs> Lupe, and kick. Don't feel weird wobbling your arms. I do that, I feel like that guy from the car wash, like woo. <laughs> your arms can help you with stability. After this, we're gonna go one more. And kick, shaky, shaky. Last one, guys. Drive those knees up. Wanna get that heart rate up. So we are ready for our workout. Yeah. Happy Friday. <laughs> Almost there. Four, three, two, one. And let's get started. So I'm just gonna make sure everything's okay. Say hi to a few more people. If you said hello. Oh my goodness. Wow, so many people. Stephanie, awesome, yes. <laughs> Yay, yeah, very better for your pocketbook, St. Clair. Carson, Amanda, Maggie, J2 Judgment, awesome. <laughs> Pam, <laughs> Izzy, hello, Maggie, shaky, 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 super chat, shaky, shaky. Thank you so much. <laughs> That's awesome, thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh, that just made my day. <laughs> All right, my dude, so we are gonna get started. 15 seconds. So we have four forward jumping jacks. So one, two, three, four. After that, you're gonna turn. One, two, three, four, okay? If you don't have room, you're just gonna do jumping jacks in place. All right, let's go. One, two, three, four. Turn. One, two, three, four. And if you can't do the side to sides, just do side to side in place. Whew. Two, three, four. Keep it up, guys. Starting out with a bang. Yes. 20 seconds. Whee. One, two, three, four. All the way. You got 10 seconds, guys. Finish it out. Four. And over. Okay. 
diamond push-ups. Hands are like this. I have them separated just a little bit because my nails tend to dig into each other. So from here, elbows in, push up, come back. If you need to come to the knees, do that. Just make sure your hips are like this. Okay, so really working triceps. <laughs> like crazy in this one. And push. If you need more stability, if your lower back's dipping, try separating your feet. That'll give you more. If it's not hard enough, try going one foot and then switch. One foot, switch. Core strong. Keep it going, guys. You can always stick with regular push-ups if that's best for you. Up. Ooh. Oh, okay. Sometimes they feel like forever. Okay, <laughs> next up, pike burpee. So we're just gonna jump into plank. From here, plank, jump your feet in, jump back up, and tuck. Take the tuck out if you need to. So back, I try to keep my legs straight as possible when I bring them in. Up, up. Keep it going. Really using that core. So bring those feet in. 20 seconds, guys. Keep it going. Up, back. Last 10. Five, four, three, two. Okay. That was fun. I'm gonna grab a weight from here. I'm gonna squat down, curtsy, lunge, and then switch legs. Okay, so squat, curtsy, back lunge, switch legs. Squat, curtsy, back lunge, switch legs. It's a nice rhythm to it. Squat, curtsy, lunge, and back. Squat. Keep it up, guys. Whew. Today's fun, right? Just a little bit brutal. Only a tiny bit. Three, two, and done. Oh, I need a water. Okay, so four switch lunges. So pretend that was four. You're gonna come down, mobile. Jump your feet out to the outside for four. Okay, one, two, three, four. Jump down, two, three, four. Remember, you can walk out the lunges. Another option for the moguls, just to twist your knee four times. Okay, still working that core. Keep it up, guys. Bringing your feet up all the way. This is brutal. <laughs> There's sometimes you got those workouts that seem a little tougher. Okay, so single leg deadlift with a row. So I'm gonna grab my weight, hold it in the left hand, stabilize on the right foot. Slight bend to that right knee, row, bring it back. So we get to catch your breath. Really squeeze that back, row towards the hips. Remember to challenge yourself with weights. All the way. Keep it going, guys. Core strong. If you need to tap that foot down in between, you can totally do that. That's all right. Row and bring it back. Whew. We're breathing. <laughs> 10 seconds. Oh my goodness. That right leg. Three, two, and done. Okay, good news. 
we're doing the other side. <laughs> so before we head into more cardio, we're gonna go with the other leg. So dumbbell on the right hand, stabilize on the left leg. Remember to hinge from the hips like a water bird. Okay, bend the knee slightly. Whenever I picture a water bird now, I always think of the one from Animal Crossing. <laughs> All the way. 30 seconds, guys. And back. Stabilizing. Making sure our knee is not collapsing in. And we're breathing. And row. Neck is neutral. So a little bit ahead of you, but not craning your neck up. 10 seconds. Now we're gonna go back to cardio. I bet you never guessed that. <laughs> Three, ah, two, one. I read that wrong, okay. So, single leg burpee. If you can't do a single leg burpee, just do a regular one. So, we're gonna stabilize on one leg, jump back, push your other leg back in a three-legged dog, jump up, and switch. That's just fun. <laughs> so, jump back, push back, come up, and switch and reach. Really reach up. It's really nice because we're getting a stretch at the same time for our hamstrings. Ooh. So if you find that the stretch is super tough, I don't want you to just accept that. I want you to think about that after your workout. Really focus on what you can change so you can better your body in all the ways. Not just cardio and strength. Four, three, two, and done. Hi. <laughs> All right, hammer girl, the girl. So I'm gonna grab this. Okay, rolling the shoulder blades back and down. Palms facing towards each other. Curl, turn palms facing up. Curl. Ooh. Okay. So this might seem a lot more challenging since a little bit out of breath. <laughs> Dang, my bicep vein. See, that's why I like when the weather gets warmer. Looks like I'm more vascular. <laughs> Vascularity, as Matt shakes his head and rolls his eyes. <laughs> I see you, Matt. <laughs> 12 seconds. Oh my goodness. Sweating just a little bit. Five. Four, three, two, and done. Okay, so next up, we're gonna go with dumbbell swing and pop. If you have a kettlebell, feel free to use it. I'm probably gonna switch, well maybe, holding it like this, get your swing down, then when it stops at the top for a second, then add the pop, okay? So make sure you're not jumping while it's swinging. Stop at the top. Squeeze your butt at the top, push your hips forward, but also squeeze your core. So that way we're not hyperextending the spine and hurting that lower back. And up. Man, we're doing so good. <laughs> we're doing so good. Keep it up, guys. 10 seconds. Whew. Five, four, Three, two, and done. Oh, okay. Ooh, next one's fun. One of my favorites. Start up, tricep push up. Jump your feet in. When you turn to the right, you're gonna kick your left leg out. Notice how my right leg is planted, okay? Jump back. So if you've done my workouts before, you know this movement. If you can't get it down right away, just try your best. Slow the movement down so you get to learn something new. You can come to the knees to the push up. Oh. Triceps, quads, uh, chest, hip opening. If you're doing this when it's not live, all you gotta do is rewind and get it. Uh, oh, oh, today is 
really fun. Okay, row to wide row. So I'm gonna grab my weights, back is flat, hinge from the hips, bend the knees slightly, row, palms facing back, wide row. Look a little bit ahead of you. Ooh. So your neck is neutral. Squeeze your core. So your lower back isn't hurting. Oh my goodness. Strength movements, so much harder. And your heart rate's up. So don't think that you're weak. Just keep going. Oh, oh we're doing so good. Keep it up, guys. You showed up. Whatever's on your mind, just think about this workout. This is your time. This is your time to put work into yourself. No other worries. Okay, so switch feet punches, getting that heart rate back up just a little bit. Start with your left foot forward, right hand forward, punch. That's it. If you want to add some weights, you can. Here we go, guys. Ooh. Just keep telling yourself you can. Because if you get in those ruts, and you're like, this is hard. I feel weak. Man, that's really fueling your mind with all those things. And then your body follows. But if you start really building yourself up, I'm strong. This is difficult, but I'm up for the challenge. Man, you'll do so much better. Feed your brain thoughts that you would feed your best friends. That sounded funny. You get it. <laughs> right? Okay. I'm going to grab my thing, my mat, roll back. Oh, that was loud. loud. Roll back to plank. If you can't do this, you're going to stick with the roll back to reach through. Roll back, plank, two plank jacks. Come back up. Roll back, plank, Two plank jacks. Keep it up, guys. Remember, we want to make sure we keep our back round, knees in, not going over the head of the neck. Oh. And uh, a lot of core and quads. <laughs> Roll it back. Doing so good, guys. Keep rocking it. Oh, up, back, one, two. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. <laughs> two walking planks, half burpee. Oh, wow, I really wanted to, to work us today. Starting to plank, walk it to the side, walk it to the side, jump your feet up, jump them back. Walk it, walk it. So it's a lot of core. Go with this angle for you. One. Keep your hands on your shoulders. Use your core to bring your feet up. Two. Up. Back. If you're like, yeah, this workout feels a little bit tough right now. I'm right with you. But we're also really strong, so. 10 seconds, Ooh. three, two, done, oh my triceps, that was great, okay, so, I love this one, start in a hero's pose, lean back, then you're going to come up, come to the balls of the feet, and then balance, okay, so, different angle, go back, come to the balls of the feet, Leg out and back. Make sure when you plant your knees down again, it's very soft. Now, if this is too much for you, you're like, yeah, I don't think so. What you can do is squat, stabilize, semicircle. Because you're still working balance. Still working those quads. All the way around. If you've done my movement flow workouts, this will feel familiar. Okay. Sorry, get our breath. Love it. Almost done with cardio. So 
We are gonna do a halo with a press, so we're working those shoulders. Uh, ah, if you wanna work your core a bit more in this one, feet together, all the way around, press. Okay, keep your core strong so you're not hyperextending the spine. All the way around, elbows in, and press. Try to keep alternating directions. But if it's too much to remember, don't worry about it. <laughs> now, make sure you're bringing the back of the head. I see a lot of people, when they think of halo, they think of bob, which I totally get it. But pretend you have a ponytail, and you bring it all the way back and press. Whew. Core is strong, again, so we're not hyper the spine. You can always stagger the feet or separate the feet. All the way around, press. Okay, yay. Okay, so next up, I'm gonna move this just a little bit. Ah! Okay, just a little bit. So, three face pumps. One, sorry, one, two, three, squat touchdown. One, two, three, squat touchdown. Two, three, squat touchdown. Think about having your feet together for the jumps and then separating them when they come down. Took me a second to get it down again. See, I goof. I goof up my moves sometimes too. Whoops, see, it's okay. Worm. Walk down, stabilize on one leg or one hand, 10 mountain climbers, walk it back. Then we have the other arm. Oh. <laughs> if you need to stabilize on both hands, that's totally cool. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10. All the way back. Oh. I was writing our workout last night and I was like, what would be super mean? <laughs> And I said that with every single move. I'm just kidding. <laughs> As you all shake your head, yes. Okay. Oh, I'm back. Oh, shaky, shaky. All the way forward. One, two. Oh my goodness. Hi. Curl with a four second negative. So we're working time under tension. So let's grab our weights and palms facing up, curl, four, three, two, one. Okay, let's go. This is a great option if you guys don't have heavier weights but you're ready to graduate. Because we're increasing the workload for those biceps with time rather than just weight. Squeeze your core. So sparkly today. <sighs> Ooh, keep it controlled. Almost there, guys. Three, two, one. Okay, now we're heading off in the core. So let's grab the, the mat that we threw. <laughs> Rolling V-ups. So what we're going to do here is you're going to face forward, have your hand up here, not up here. From here you're going to crunch, head and shoulders feet off the ground, crunch. If you can't do that, you can always do one leg and I'll tell you when to switch halfway. So keep it up. If you have the rolls or not, <laughs> not the cinnamon rolls. Ooh, although that sounds really good. <laughs> if you're sticking on one side, switch halfway. So we're getting obliques, but when we roll, we're getting the front of that core too. So this is just really mean. <laughs> you're welcome. <sighs> Five, four, three, two, and done. Hi. Okay, 
So next up, windshield wiper use. So for this one, arms are out into a T. You're gonna bring your legs up, go over, point your toes over to the right, make a U, bring it back up, and then make a U. Now, if this is too intense, bend the knees. Now you could just go side to side instead, but if you're with me, whoo, these are fun. Oh my gosh, this is where you're gonna really feel the heat in your face. <laughs> Remember when we were cold during winter? Whew. Good times. Just kidding. I love this. Right. Keep going, guys. Twelve seconds. That is nothing. Oh, baby. Or baby. Five, four, three, two, and done. Okay. Reverse crunch with a one leg lower. Now this is where my back might start farting because I'm sweaty. You can support your lower back if you want. Bring it up, lower one leg. Always think about keeping your back flat on the ground. So if you don't support your lower back, really, again, make sure that lower back isn't coming up. It's nice and flat. Takes a lot more control, which means you might not get as many reps, but the reps you do are more effective. Take your time, breathe. We only have one move after this. Yes. All right. Keep it up, guys. I just want to take this time to thank you so much for coming to work out with me. It really means a lot. So thank you. Oh, keep going, guys. And done. Okay, last one. We're gonna come into a plank. Oh, so shiny. <laughs> Matt, you're gonna recognize this. So you wanna exhale all the air in your lungs as you reach slowly to the opposite side hip. So this is so slow and controlled. So slow. Like I wanna hear it. <laughs> all the air. Really exaggerate it. Keeping your hips as straight as you can. All the way. Oh my goodness. Cruel move. <laughs> 10 seconds. And done, done. Oh, I did it, wait. And done. <laughs> I gotta shut it off the, oh no. Oh no, you guys, no. This was supposed to happen. Stop, please stop. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I was about to like go out the room and just throw it and be like, I'll catch you later. Okay, <laughs> all right guys, so we are doing some stretching now. Thank you for sticking with me through that painful experience. Let's go ahead and have our left leg in front and our right leg bent like this. From here, go tall in that spine. Big inhale, exhale. One more big inhale. And as you exhale, twist towards the left. Take your right hand to the left knee, left hand and back, and twist. So this should feel really nice for the spine. Keep breathing. Still very tall in that spine. And go ahead and slowly bring it back. Ooh, shaky, shaky. Hands planted behind you. We're gonna switch. Do the same thing. Big inhale to start out with. Exhale. Big inhale, grow tall. Exhale, twist. Left hand to right knee, right hand and back. Turn, look over that shoulder. Nice soft face. I feel this in my hips as well because they're tighter on this side. And let's go ahead and bring it back to center. Nice job. All right, from here, we're gonna have our feet out wide. I wanna give you that view. <laughs> feet out wide. We're gonna have our hands planted behind us, grow tall on the spine, and go ahead and push forward. Really think about digging those heels in the ground, pointing your toes out. So you should feel this in the inner and outer thighs, the hips, 
If you're super flexible, maybe an axle latch, that's okay. And go ahead and bring those feet together. And we're gonna lay down, bless, right? <laughs> go ahead, grab your knees in, make some circles. And then go the other way. And let's bring that right knee in, left leg out, and pulse. You should really feel this in the right hip flexor. You can add some ankle circles if you want to. And let's go ahead and take that right knee with the left hand, cross over the body, bringing our right arm to the right, looking over the right shoulder. Another nice spine twist. And go ahead and bring it back just a little bit. Ooh, let's switch. Left knee in that chest and paw. Breathe. You can add some ankle circles here. And let's go ahead and cross it over that body. Left arm to the left, look over that left shoulder. Breathe. And let's bring it back to center. Knees in, hopefully no back parts. <laughs> roll up, and we're gonna roll over onto all fours. From here, let's walk our hands forward onto the fingertips, bringing our chest down, moving side to side, really opening up the shoulders. Breathe here. And let's walk it back. Woo! <laughs> All right, we're gonna come into crisscross applesauce here. Get a little bit more upper body and then we'll head into our mini meditation. So let's bring our left arm across the body and pull. Look over that left shoulder. Nice tall spine, nice soft face. So soft, moisturize. <laughs> you can go ahead and shake it out. Other side. Breathe. Go ahead and shake it out. I'm gonna face this way so you can see better and it's a little bit less awkward of a movement. So we're gonna have our uh, fingertips facing out or if you feel comfortable here too, you can do this. I like to do this here because it gets more of my biceps. So tuck the chin, the chest, push your hips up. Whew. So I feel this in my biceps and my hips. You can always just stay down here and then open up your chest if that's more comfortable for you. But biceps are one of those things that we work a lot, but we don't tend to stretch as much. But we need to, to make sure we're doing that to slowly come down so we don't get things like golfer's elbow and any kind of issues, pains like that. Whew. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and we're going to head into our mini meditation. You're welcome to lay down. You're welcome to stay here, crisscross applesauce. So let's go ahead and close our eyes wherever you are. Hands on the knees if you're with me here. Big inhale through that nose. Exhale through the mouth. Big inhale. Exhale. All right, you guys keep cycling through breaths, whether normal or deep breaths, whatever feels best for you. Right now, spring has started. And we're heading into this different season. And it's important to remember that we also go through seasons. Sometimes we're on it, we're super motivated, and we keep on going, and sometimes we're in a slump. And all we want to do is huddle up into a ball. So wherever you are, I think it's important to begin to acceptance of that. Sometimes we need some extra rest. Or sometimes we realize, hey, we need to kiss some butt now. It is the season. But I wanted to actually just take this time to really think about adding guilt to yourself for wherever you are. Do you feel like you need to be somewhere else? Do you feel like you haven't done enough? Do you feel like I'm age, blah, blah, blah. I should be, blah, blah, blah. 
for right here and right now is what we have. So if you have any of that guilt that you're holding on to, or maybe something you did in the past, I want you to bring it to the forefront of your mind. And picture it as a black ball of light. And I want you to roll your shoulder blades back and down, go tall on that spine, take a deep breath. And as you exhale, I want you to imagine that blackness just melting away and all you're left with is this white ball of light. And that blackness is any guilt that you have. You have right here and right now, and you're doing so amazing. You guys showed up to this workout. You guys showed up for yourselves to improve yourselves, which is so amazing. So right now, be very, very proud of yourself. Take this time to really be proud of yourself for showing up, for being here, because if you're here right now, that means you conquered anything that was super tough in your life up until this point, which is so amazing. So goodbye, guilt. We don't need you. And hello, acceptance and being proud of this moment right now. So go ahead, big inhale, really big inhale, exhale. And with that ball of light, with your inhale, I want you to imagine it coming into your nose, filling up your entire body, and exhale, spreading out through your body, and it is now part of you. Go ahead, slowly open your eyes, maybe wiggle your toes with your hands. Let's do a big inhale, arms out in front, up, 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 and exhale, oh, sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. We are done for today, yay! Thank you guys so, so much. I hope that meditation helped you. It's one of those things that there was a person in my Q&A when I did a live Q&A a few weeks ago. They are like, I feel like I should be somewhere else. Like, how do you get rid of that? Like guilt, I'm like, well, it doesn't help you to hold onto that guilt. It doesn't propel you towards your goals, you know? Society tells us that we should be at this point, or we see someone on Instagram that's like 12 years old and who has their own business already, and we compare ourselves when really that's not helping us in this present moment, and we don't need to be anywhere else but right here, right now. So I hope that helps you guys, and I hope you take that with you because that ball of light is now a part of you. Haha, -ha, I tricked you. <laughs> so I want to thank you guys so much for joining me. I'm going to look at all the comments. Shaky, shaky. Thank you so much for joining me. I really, I just appreciate you guys so much. Oh my God. Whoa. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> this is crazy. Ah, Akita. Pee for a second. <laughs> yeah, you're going to really like this one, Akita, when you can do it. Thank you so much. I'll shaky, shaky all these. Bottling and sunshine, no worries that you're late. You can always do it when you can do it. 62 people are crazy. Ellie, yay, great job. Mommy, thank you, Pam. Thank you so much. Leanne, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna shaky, shaky. Oh my goodness. Great job. Okay. Oh, Farida, thank you so much. Sonia, Carolina, I don't know what that means. That's crazy. Wow. Oh my gosh. I know. <laughs> Leanne, it was seriously brutal. First, let me shaky, shaky. Thank you guys so much. So, so much for, for all that. I'm not sure what SEK is, but that's great. Where are you from, Carolina? <laughs> Chrissy, I know, right? Stephanie, oh, you're so close to doing push-ups. That's freaking awesome. Hi, Terrence. St. Clair, brutal but fun. I know. I was like, it's not just me, right? It's not just because it's like warmer and I'm wearing pants. <laughs> thank you so much, Kirsten. Yes, yeah, I would love it. Oh, thank Chris. Thank you so much, Kirsten. Thank you, thank you. Dan, hello from Amsterdam. Sonia, oh, I'm so glad you like the meditations. I really want you guys to be able to take those with you. Oh, please do like the video before you go, um, if you're leaving. Thank you so much. Um, but yeah, I really hope you take those with you because we're so good with, with you know, building ourselves up physically, but mentally, that's that's where the magic happens. <laughs> so I'll see here. Um, Emma, thank you, thank you, thank you. Matt, oh, I'm so glad you liked it. Did you like the core move at the end? It reminded me of you. <laughs> Diego, hello, hello. Oh my gosh. Just thank you guys so much. Oh, you need it. We need it. Um, so next week, same time, 
same place. Don't forget to like the video before you go. Thank you so much for super chatting, you guys. It really means a lot to support my channel. Thank you so much. If you can't super chat for some reason, because I totally understand, there also is a link in my description to support my channel. But also, if you just share my video too, that is awesome too. Because I just want to like help as many people as possible. So, ah, uh, thank you guys. Have an amazing rest of the day. Do all the things. And let me know if you have any requests for workouts soon. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. Are you excited? Have a great day, everyone. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is so exciting. Wow. <laughs> Rawr. Rawr.